They are essential workers who come into contact with a lot of people. We're talking about grocery store workers. Now there's a push to boost their pay in two of the Bay Area's biggest cities. NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith has those details for us. Yes, and it would be an additional $5 an hour for these workers. Oakland City Council President Nikki Fortunato Bass is introducing legislation Tuesday to provide hazard pay for grocery workers in the largest stores in Oakland, ones that are more than 15,000 square feet with 500 or more workers nationwide. They estimate there are more than 2,000 grocery workers in the city. She says she's heard from workers who are scared and worried about new strains of the virus. In San Jose, a similar proposal would include large stores with at least 300 workers nationwide. In Oakland, they point out with the nature of the job, it makes sense. And these are workers in our grocery stores who have been working every day since the pandemic in contact with lots and lots of people. So as COVID rages on, it's really important that these workers who are making sure that we can buy the food and supplies that we need as we shelter in place, these workers need to be fairly compensated for the dangers that they are um, exposing themselves to. She says some employers are already offering additional compensation and they would certainly get credit for that. Meantime, some within the industry say companies have taken extra steps to protect workers and worry that grocery costs could rise. Both proposals would be temporary. If it were approved, Oakland's hazard pay ordinance would be in effect at least until Oakland enters the yellow tier. Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News.